Bulls fans, I'm Brittany Bajardi here with your Bulls Vision Update on GoUSFBulls.com. Now we're in former Dodger Town here at Vero Beach Sports Village and today we're touring the facilities just to show you, the fans, what it's like to be here out on training camp this week. Now if you look behind me, there is a batting cage that the baseball players used to play at and the Bulls get to practice right here in this facility. So let's check out the facility and see what it's all about. The facility that the USF is training at right now is uh, currently known as Vero Beach Sports Village. Uh, for 62 years it was known as Dodger Town. The reason it's Dodger Town is because in 1948 the Brooklyn Dodgers uh, came here looking for a site that they could train all of their players. Uh, Jackie Robinson was just breaking into baseball then and there were certain towns in the south that were uh, raining out games not allowing Jackie Robinson uh, to play, eat, sleep, recreate, and practice along with uh, his uh, other ball player friends and uh, players. So um, the Dodgers in 1948 came to what was a naval air base during World War II, where we're standing at right now, um, that uh, the city of Vero Beach had it deeded back to them. Uh, the Dodgers were looking for, once again, a home. Uh, Vero Beach was looking for a use of an old naval air base, and uh, in 1948, 600 Brooklyn Dodgers came into Vero Beach. Last night, just talked a little bit about the history and the great sports teams that have been through this facility, and you look at the number of championships that have been won that started right here. We talked a little bit about that last night and kind of what we're trying to build. and. Uh, talked about uh, this kind of helping Jackie Robinson breaking the color barrier and everything else and uh, it was funny because some of the guys didn't have hot water this morning and so at the end of practice I always say who's got a question or a problem and somebody <laughs> said coach we, we didn't have any hot water and another room said well we didn't either we didn't either and somebody stood up and said Jackie Robinson didn't have hot water let's call it up <laughs> I mean it's just they've had a lot of fun with it but I thought that was a great thing to do in the first night to explain a little bit about the history of this place and where we are we're not just at a camp you know, we're at a Dodger town and the legends that have walked across these fields and stayed in these dorm rooms and eaten in this dining facility and everything else. I think that's all part of what they need to understand, the history and the tradition that has been through this great place. Because there's uh, very limited distractions out here and everyone's all on the same schedule. So we're all, you know, working together, we're living together and uh, I think it brings everyone closer. 